All right, everybody. I'm Ricky Martinez backstage at Valentine's Crush here with Z Trip. Z, how are you doing, we are man? Close. It is Valentine's Day. I love Day it. It's V Day. We're getting lovey dovey up in here. That's right. I want to know how you and LL got hooked up. How'd you guys? Oh get? wow. We um, well, we linked up. There was somebody who reached out to us to do a project together, um, and the project ended up falling through. But he and I actually became friends. I asked him to come out and perform with me, uh, be my special guest at South by Southwest a couple years ago. And uh, so I headlined that stage, he came out, the crowd lost their minds. And um, we had such a good time performing together that he was like, I think I may want to get back into this music stuff. And I was like, <laughs> awesome. I sort of, you know, I sort of drug him over into this world again. And, you know, he was a little hesitant. But now that, you know, after we did that, he got fired up about it because, That's I mean, dope. you know. So we have Z Trip input on the Authentic album then. Correct. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. Yeah, I co-produced the track that we just performed on the Grammys. Um, and, uh, and that was a whole That other. was a great, Thank that you. was a great yeah. performance. Everybody from Chuck D to you to LL, Travis Barker, Travis, Tom Morello everybody. from Rage Against the Machine. We brought, I basically made the call, got everybody to get together. Mm. We did it in like a week and a half and it was, Man. uh, it was like, yo, we're going in. And the, the best thing about it is, you know, it's the Grammys. None of us were nominated for anything. We just rolled there. in there on some like, Running we're going to bum rush, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay, we're good. talking LL, it's Valentine's Day. One of the most talked about hip hop love songs has to be I Need Love by LL Cool J. I've never heard that song. What? Man. I'm joking, I'm joking, okay, I'm joking, I'm joking. which brings my next question. <laughs> Have you ever <laughs> smashed to I Need Love by LL Cool J? Oh, wow. And I know he's your homie, so this might be a little crazy. But... Uh, I'm going to have to take the fifth on that. You just oh can't put me on the spot. Gosh. I mean, come on. Okay. She and... knows who she is. <laughs> it was a special <laughs> moment, I bet. Okay. Have you, you ever I think I have. I think I've made, I scammed. I scammed. To I, I, love. I made lust. <laughs> yes. Okay, you're going to be judging the Red Bull contest yes. coming up, right? I want to know what you look for or what makes a great A DJ according to Z Trip. Uh, well, I mean, you got to sort of have all bases covered, you know? You got to be able to perform, you got to be able to select, you got to have skills. Um, there's really a lot. I have a checklist, you know, I could go down the line. All the, you know, yeah. if you're a DJ though, you know, you have to have all these things to be well rounded. Yeah. And if the well rounded person to me is. is sort of the catalyst for it but mm -hmm. they also have to take that step outside the box because if you're not doing anything yeah. interesting and, and pushing the boundaries then it's like that what creativity. are you doing for? can you so. spot like a sucker dj <laughs> yeah i'm pretty of course sure you the can. radars like, you can hear them you just like, you hear them, all like, the party breaks that mm -hmm. they play <laughs> yeah you can do Every, everybody can i think at this day and age those guys don't get over anymore because so many people are actually becoming djs it's really accessible That's to be to be a true. dj so um, I think, thank God, those people are slowly falling by the wayside. You know, That's cool, man. you hear them, in, you hear them in the dive bars, not in the clubs. You, not like, so much. They're yeah. slowly getting weeded out of the mix. Now, Z, besides being on the authentic album, are we seeing anything coming from you? Yeah, I'm actually finishing up my record. I'm hoping to have it done in the next couple months. Um, I've got some really cool guests on it, and um, some, you know, obviously original production. I'm mm -hmm. super stoked to get it out there. But I've also been, you know, dealing with the with the LL's album, and yeah. we're touring, so there's. There's nonstop, you know. I just did a the Coachella cruise. Z yeah, nonstop. It's How like, was the Coachella cruise? It was amazing. Cruise. I heard about that. I didn't know if it would be cool, but it happened right around the time that the Mayan calendar was supposed to end. So oh, everyone was sort of like, "We're the, this the, the last Man. cruise. We're gonna cruise off the side of the planet." <laughs> but uh, it was amazing. Do you recommend that? To go on the Coachella uh, Yeah, cruise? definitely. I think I mean, you know, if um, it's definitely something you should experience if you've never been on a cruise. I mean, being on a cruise ship with all the musicians mm -hmm. and all the fans. It's like, you know, Man. we had a great time. Went to the Bahamas, went to Jamaica. Ooh, it was dope. that sounds like fun. Now, are we going to be seeing you check out Coachella by any chance? Yeah, I'll definitely be there. Of course, every year. Raging? Every year. I'm going too, so we got to rage together. Yeah, I'm down, I'm down. Yeah! Whether I'm performing or I'm, I'm going, I, I'm always there. <laughs> Give it up. Z Trip here. I'm Ricky Martinez, Big Boys Neighborhood. We're at Valentine's Crush. Peace.